Hello everyone, my name is Haven, and today I'm reacting to De Devour It, The Universe. That's such a, a weird, weird way to say that, I guess. Usually you think Devourer of the Universe or something. No, Devour It of the Universe. But the song is Venomous Duality. So, being another band from Slam Worldwide, I know nothing of this group. But based on what the visuals look like just from the thumbnail that I've seen... Looks like it's going to be heavy as hell. So we're going to jump right into this and jam out to some uh, Devour the Universe. Okay, so before we continue on, ah, uh, it doesn't sound too bad. I really like it. Um, it kind of, even though I haven't heard any early signs of the swarm, I would like to think that this gives me sign early signs of the swarm vibes, maybe, or maybe a little bit of a heavier Chelsea grin, I suppose. You know, like maybe early days Chelsea grin, which is, uh, you know, nothing wrong with that in the slightest. And maybe I'm wrong. I'm sure somebody could probably compare these guys to something. Far, far else, somewhere else. So it ain't bad at all. I think I'm really more intrigued with the uh, the visuals in the background. You know, it might, just looking at it makes me think of StarCraft for some reason. Like, this person right here would probably be like a ghost, kind of like Kerrigan, before she turned into um, the, the Hive Queen. And then you got like a, a Terran, what would look like a Terran right here. So <laughs> I'm like definitely getting like some StarCraft vibes. Now imagine if a band, especially maybe even this band, I, I don't care who does it. If they did a, a StarCraft themed metal band, that would be badass. But let's continue on. <laughs> So that part right there, what I was picking up from that would be like something like if you went to like one of those fifteen dollar uh, metal shows at a venue that you probably never he ever heard of, and like it'd be just a bunch of no name bands there, and it's like a hardcore show or whatever. That's what I got from that right there. Uh, not a lot of bands do that. Usually, actually, when you think about it, a lot of underground bands, I think, do that whole part right there. It's very interesting because you know, out of all the mu music I listen to. Um, I don't think I've ever really heard anybody do that part. Like, do that, what they were just doing. Um, yeah, thinking about it. Even, even the, you know, the bands that I have gone and seen live, 
you know and so usually when you think about it it's like yeah usually mostly underground bands do stuff like that I mean, even even close to slam type bands so very interesting <laughs> that logo that looks badass uh so this was a pretty good song overall would it would it be something i would jam out to uh i mean yeah i i could see myself like listening to this like you know if i'm at work or you know working out or whatever even though i don't work out i should but i don't uh i would listen to this you know like i, I could see myself like uh, if it was on Spotify and I just happened to come across, I'd be, I'd be jamming out to it at work or whatever. But I don't know. I mean, I feel like this is something, you know, like they're really good. Just, just let's just say that they're really good. Uh, I would definitely recommend this to some of my friends because uh, they're like me, always looking for new music and finding new bands. So this would be something worth recommending. So what do you guys think? You like it? You hate it? Let me know in the comments below. And uh, with that being said, if you have uh, any songs or bands that you want to recommend, let me know. And I will gladly react to them. So with that being said, I hope you guys have a lovely rest of your day. Drink plenty of water, even though I'm over here drinking Mountain Dew. But, you know, how often do we get Baja Blasts unless we go to, like, Taco Bell? So drink water or get yourself a Baja Blast somewhere. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.